have you ever noticed that liberals have a problem with patriotism? They want athletes to kneel during the anthem. They want to do away with the pledge. And now, apparently, they have a problem with the flag. It happened at my alma mater, Trinity. A student hung an American flag outside his dorm, which had a blue stripe for the cops, a red stripe for the firemen, and a green stripe for the federal agents. But the dean didn't like this one bit. And they had someone go to the dorm and rip down the kids' flags. But here's the problem. Apparently, no one did anything about the pride flags hanging up everywhere on campus. In fact, the college celebrated those. It's the patriotic flags outside the dorms that have to go. You see, the handbook says they're a safety concern. Watch this. Excuse me? Why are you guys touching our property? You were asked to take it down. Who are, who are you touching our flags? You have no right to do this. Can Why? Microphone Absolutely not. I have every right to record, and you know that. This is America. We have the First Amendment right of freedom of speech, freedom of expression. So are you going to take down the other flags? Everyone's being asked to take them down. So well, they're being Why asked, but, we're, but our flags are being forced. ripped off. So what about that flag right there? Why don't you guys take that one first? I'm waiting to hear directors from our dean. The message is going to be going out. What do you mean you're waiting to hear from our dean? You just took our flags down. Excuse me, I'll, I'll take my flags. Thank They're you They're going to go to the dean's office. I'll take my flags. Do not touch me. I bought these. You're not uh, taking my property. This is stealing. <laughs> she keeps mentioning the dean. Who is the dean? Well, if they're anything like the president of the college, it makes sense. You see, Trinity President Sweeney isn't a fan of waters. But I'm not going to get into that right now. The good news is President Sweeney noticed this little flag incident got a little traction, and now she feels bad about it. She sent out a little email to all the students saying, quote, as I understand the matter, an apology was issued on the same day of the removal to the students who own the flags for the manner in which the policy was enforced. We will work harder to ensure greater awareness and consistent compliance moving forward, yada, yada, yada. Well, we reached out to the patriots who got their flags taken down. Lucas Turco and Finn McColl join me now. So other flags are hanging. What kind of flags do they have hanging? Well, they had uh, they had LGBTQ flags. They had um, transgender flags, BLM flags. Which you know we have no problem with any of those flags hanging. We believe everyone has a right to their own opinion and their own beliefs, and that everyone should be able to put their flags up. And so me and Finn thought, why don't we put up some flags that we personally believe in? And what kind of flag was it? You guys had the so, Blue Lives Matter kind of flag. Yes, the, the had, don't tread on me. Yes, we had a don't tread on me American flag, symbolizing our love of freedom, love of equality for all people. And of course, the uh, green line, red line, blue line flag that showed our respect, our reverence for first responders, our, our family members, our firemen, police officers. Well, thank you guys to your family. Yeah, of course. Did they explain how that flag was a security threat? <laughs> security? I, I don't really think that they mes mentioned that. They said that the reason that they were taken down was because some people viewed the flags as offensive. Ooh. And I think that's absolutely a shame that those flags could be offensive when, you know, they're just about loving our country and the people who uh, protect us. What happened to Trinity? When I was there, there was no politics. It was just drinking and sports. <laughs> the squash team was good. The football team was good. And that's all anybody cared about. Now there's like some sort of radical flag action. Sad, yeah, it's sad. I mean, from our conversations with the dean, they seemed, you know, very open to apologizing with us, but it doesn't change the fact of what you saw in the video there. I mean, um, it's a sad state of affairs, but, you know, we don't hold hate in our hearts for these people. The incident occurred, but... You know, we're, we're open to having productive conversations with them going forward. Thank you guys very much. Thank you for taking Thank the you. Time. Thank you for having us on. Too. All right. Good job. Way to stand up for things. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.